pictures in the community feed. Something that I've never done. I really don't use the community feed, but I'm gonna start engaging a little bit more. So yeah, color work out good. Um, I'm, not, I'm not getting paid to promote this product, but I do suggest you try it out. It works, it's nice. It's a go-to. Ted and Tans, and do a little quick video today. Um, I've been wanting some dye in my hair for a while, but my loctician say my hair isn't completely locked, so I can't get it. And I got a fresh retie last week, and as you can see, you can see my grid pretty good, doing good, it's growing. You can see how thick it is back there the length but anyway let me get started because i don't want this to be long so yeah i'm about to put some red dye in my hair you know what let me take my well i take that back not dye because i was told not to get dye i'm going to put some red wax in my hair take off my earrings i should have taken off my shirt too but that's okay since i'm using red wax i'm gonna put a red burgundy towel around me so it won't get on my clothes so it's red wax it's called muffa mofa jang mofa jang or mafa jang i'm gonna open it up so you guys can see what it looked like This is what I'm about to experience with. Take a little experiment. Hopefully it comes out good. And this is the box it came in. It's got Chinese writing. It was packaged pretty good. I ordered it off of Amazon. And how I found out about this uh, red wax, I follow a sister lock group on Facebook. And um, I, this young lady had commented about the type of wax that she uses on her sister locks. So, she even linked her um, YouTube channel, which I'll put her information up there, up there somewhere, so you all can follow her if you're interested. But, you know, I must give her a shout out. I think her name is Renee's Sister Locks. I think, anyway, I'll, I'll put it. Um, so, I like what it did for her hair, and I'm gonna try it out. Oh, I almost knocked over my distilled water. So, I'm making a mess already. Anyway, I'm back. So, this is distilled water. I miss my hair with distilled water or alkaline water. So, before you put the, um, the wax on your hair, the color wax, you should mist your hair with water or rose water. Uh, you don't want to put the wax on dry hair from my understanding. You could have a big mess. So I'm going to do it sections at a time so I can keep it away from my hair tend to dry up pretty fast when I mist it. So, okay, it's good. Wet. Ooh. Okay. I'm not going to put it all the way to my roots because I don't want my whole head to be red. I just kind of want a little something, something going on on the ends. Going on on the ends and ends. Okay. So, this little section is wet. Uh-oh. da 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 da, -da. <laughs> I'm going to take a scoop. Um, they say a little bit goes a long way. So, this is what I'm taking to put... No, I think I'm going to rub it in on my gloves. Uh, make the best. And here we go. Here we go. Oh, snap. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I should have took my shirt off. Okay. It look more pink than red, but I guess when it dry, I shall see. 
And like I said, I'm not trying to go to the roots. I just want to have a little color on my ends. I'd be like, Ted, what you think about this? Ted be like, whatever, whatever you like. I think that's good. Can you see? Can you see how instantly my hair dropped compared to this side? When it has a little moisture to it, a little weight to it, it instantly dropped. It's hanging this side up here. <laughs> anyway, all right. So, let me go ahead and put this in a little plait right quick. Oh man, I should have just sprayed my whole head. Cause now I'm about to mess up my water bottle. I'm just planting it so it can stay in place and not be swinging everywhere. So, uh, I'm about to mess up my water bottle. Ugh, it's okay. It should be able to rinse off. So, let me spray this side real good. And once again, I use the still water. Okay. I'm gonna put a little bit more water. That's still a little dry. Oh, in case you didn't hear me, I said, let me put a little bit more water because that still looks dry. I keep forgetting I'm recording a video. So once again, I'm gonna take a little scoop. A little scoop goes a long way. And I'm getting ready to go on vacation in a couple of months. And I said, let me try this out. Cause I don't want to wait till the day before I go on vacation, be trying to put this in my hair and I don't like it. And then be trying to wash it out. So let me go ahead on and experiment with it now. So you see, I'm just rubbing my fingers through there. Just rubbing my fingers through there. Just rubbing my fingers through there. And I'm gonna do the same thing. See how I just drop? How the hair drop? The shrinkage is real. So I'm gonna get being loose. So I'm gonna take my hair and divide it in the back. Separate it. All right. I'm gonna spray this side with a little bit more distilled water. You may say, well, why do you use still water? I don't know, because I be drinking distilled water and uh, I drink alkaline water. So I feel like if I can drink, drink it, I can spray it on my hair. I don't really care for tap water, even though when I wash my hair, I'm washing it with tap water. But when I spray my hair, it's just what I use, distilled water. Miss, miss. All right, I think I got it good in moisture. Wait, all right, let me, ooh, I'm making a mess, oh my God, oh. Yep, Lord. Okay, oh. Just massage it in there, rub it in there real good. Like I said, it looks pink. Doesn't look red, but on the young lady's video that I watched in the picture that she posted in the Facebook group, her hair didn't look, it looked kind of reddish, burkinish. It was real pretty. Hair was real pretty, pretty lady. Okay. All right. So I'm going to do these. Another plant. And you know, once I finish with the plaits and stuff, I'm gonna stop the video and I'll come back when it's dry and let you all see what it looks like. Um, loose, and then I, I might do a couple of styles. I might, I might do a little something. I got a little extra time. Oh gosh, all right. All right. I know the next time I do this, I'm gonna cover up my sink because with this water and this wax dripping off these gloves, I'm getting it all over my sink. Yeah, 
you know what I mean, my um, guest bathroom, well, one of the guest bathrooms, because it's just me. I mean, we do have kids, but um, nobody lives with us. My girls are off living their life, and the boys live with their mom, so it's just me and Teddy in this big old house by ourselves. Anyway. And I normally don't be in this bathroom. I keep it clean. So when I do have company, it's clean. But I have a mess in this thing. I'm going to work tomorrow as a redhead baby. They're going to be like, hmm, trying something new. Yep, and, and is, and did. See how the hair stretches? Look how the hair hanging. <laughs> it was not hanging like this. <sighs> but I tell you. The shrinkage, the shrinkage, the shrinkage. All right. So now you see I got four plaids. I've sprayed each area. I don't know if you can see it back there. So this is where I'm going to end the video. And once it's dry, I'll come back and show you what it looked like. I'll probably do a couple of styles as well. So Okay, I'm back. The hair is dry. I want y'all to see. Can you see the color? I like it. It's not pink. It's actually burgundy, reddish color. It came out good. I like it. Exactly what I was looking for. Uh, let me see. Let you see how it looks hanging down on both sides. Okay. This is what your girl has been wanting. A little color. See? See the color? Looks good. Can you see it? I hope you can see it. I don't know if you can see how long it's hanging with my head up. <laughs> I'm just goofing off, just goofing off, just goofing off. Let me bring it all the way up so you can see. All the way to the front. I want you to see just how good this wax is. If I had applied more, it would probably be even darker. No, probably be brighter. So, see? I want you to see the color. Okay. All right. So, I'm actually going to style my hair. Put a little style on. Put on a little eyeliner and lip gloss. I may, you know, put a little something on my face. But I'm not an everyday makeup girl. I don't even know how I really do makeup. So when you see my face beat, which isn't often, just know my friend Peaches did it or my daughter Day Day did it when she's home visiting. Okay? All right. Hey guys, I'm back. I promised that I was gonna come back and show you how the color look once I style my hair. And I did um, two days ago. I forgot to record a video. And I said, whoops, let me record this, you know, before it starts to get a little rough. But I do like my hair a day later after it's done. So I wanted to come to you and show you how I styled it. Can you see that color? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You see it? It came out real good, just like I like it. I think the next time I do it, I'm gonna apply a little bit more so I can get a little bit bolder. I mean, this looks good, but I can go a little bit bolder. 
Who am I? Anyway, um, because of my job, I really don't like to wear my hair down. So I decided to twist it up from the left side going up in an angle to the right and um, lead the hair out some towards the front. Um, the longer part of the hair was intentionally caught up into the twist to bring the twist up so I wouldn't have so much hair hanging out on my shoulder because I'd be hot, sweating, and everything at work. So, um, yeah, this is it. This is it. That's the side. Let me show you what the back look like. Hold on. Turn around. Okay. You can see how it's twisted. Around. Up. And it goes all the way up. And this braid goes all the way up and around. I hope you can see this, what I'm saying. Anyway. You get the idea. And I can't take credit for doing these twists, you no, know, by myself, my friend Peaches, she pretty much twisted up my hair. So when I'm at work, I kind of like pull it back a little bit out my face. So it won't be in my face. So I might take a pin and pin it right there. But if I'm gonna go out, I just get a little wild with it. Let it fall in my face. You know, a little cute. Go on a little lip gloss, a little lipstick or something. So you guys, this is what the color is looking like. I'm loving it. I like it so much that I'm thinking I'm gonna branch out into another color. Um, no time soon. I'm gonna keep experimenting with this color. And like I say, I probably won't even rinse this out. I'll probably just wet my hair and apply more to get a bolder color. And what I can say is I can rub it. There's nothing on my hands. If it, if it is something on my hands, it's the bare minimum. So, you know, nothing's gotten on my clothes or anything. So, hey, and that young lady's name was not Renee. Her channel is called Lena's. And once again, I'm gonna um, add it into the, um, the video. So I'm gonna wear this style a couple of more days and I'm gonna take it down. And I'll probably do one more style, you know, maybe a bun or just bring all my hair to the side and let it hang down. So you guys can see how the color looks hanging down. But um, yeah, da 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 da. I'm loving it, yeah. All right, I'll be back in a few days and finish up this video and put it together and put it out for you all if you're interested in hair wax. I got a couple of compliments today and people are asking me where did I get the hair wax because they actually thought it was dye. But your girl said, no, 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 no. I'm not ready for dye. And at this point, I probably won't get dye. I'll stick to hair wax. <laughs> okay. But in the meantime, see you guys later. Okay, I'll be back. Hi guys, I'm back. I finally took my hair down from the twist out, not twist out, but the twist up style I had. I had a twist up and hanging to the side. You seen it, you just seen it in the clip before, so you know what I'm talking about. But um, as promised, I said I was gonna come back a week later and show you what it looks like once I take my hair down. And I wanted to come and show you that the color is still in there. It's, it's giving what it's supposed to give, gave what it was supposed to give. Um, it's still in there. This side was out more, so it may appear that I don't have more color towards the front. And I'm a hand, hand to hair type of girl. I keep my hands in my locks, I don't know. It's, you would think I just got my sister locks the way I keep my hands in my hair. I just don't know. I can't keep my hands out. Anyway, yeah, so I like the color. I like it so much that I'm not gonna wash my hair. I'm not gonna rinse it out or anything. I'm gonna mist my hair with more um, alkaline water this evening when I get back from running my errands. And I'm gonna apply a little more color to bring it out more. I'm not gonna twist it up in the style. I'm going to more than likely just wear it down like this or flip to the side or my favorite style, which is a bun. 
I pull it up and put it in the bun, but I just want to apply more color to see how bold it can get. I'm not getting permade, uh, permade, Lord, permade. What is, what is that, permade? Anyway, I'm not getting paid to promote this uh, product, but I do suggest you try it out. If you're like me and you want, to, want color and you're not fully locked, and you know, it, this is an option. So, yep, your girl like it. And by the month, I say mid-September, I'll probably try out another color, but I'm gonna rock with this. It's supposed to be red, it's reddish, burgundish, whatever. I like it, so I'm gonna rock with it. So, this is it guys, you see it lasted. And I can like rub my hair, rub my hair. I'm just getting tongue tied today, forgive me. Um, just rubbing my hands through my hair, and you can see there's barely any color coming out on my hands. Just minimal, minimal, minimum color. Something that I can live with. But anyway, so that's that. I'm gonna go ahead and put all these clips together, get this video out to you guys. Thanks for watching. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. It doesn't matter. It's all engagement. It gets me into the algorithm. So with that being said, you all have a great day. All right? Till the next time. <laughs>